hello all i hope you guys are doing fantastic my name is soman and welcome back to my channel so today i'm standing at mp highlander it's a ferry that you need to take from north sydney uh, if you want to go to newfoundland so today we are going to newfoundland and uh, this is uh, mid of june 18th june 2023 and it's almost uh, 12.30 midnight uh, the ferry has started at 11.15 and it's a very smooth process so we have driven from Halifax uh, it's four hours drive from Halifax four and a half hours almost and uh, you need to reach here by 9.15 because if you reach uh, after that so there are probably they may deny your reservation that's what they said as per their ticket so make sure you you should plan to reach here i mean uh, to reach the north sydney ferry terminal uh, by 9 pm in the evening and also the google map is very much confusing if you are driving from halifax or anywhere uh, in fact and if you want to drive to the north ferry uh, north sydney ferry terminal it is very confusing okay because google map is not properly updated and it will take you to the wrong place that's called uh, uh, cruise terminal but it's not a cruise terminal you need to see you need to watch out the signboard over the road there is a bridge you can remember there is a overbridge and just beside the overbridge there would be a sign and you need to follow that sign and you need to take the right street or maybe it should be in your left right so from wherever you are coming so you need to watch out for the uh, the street uh, like no, the sign signboard basically so don't just follow uh, google map blindly okay it's an advice because today we have taken at least three or four wrong turns uh, before ultimately we reach uh, the actual ferry terminal okay? so it's an advice so anyway so i'm very much excited right now i'm sitting here uh, in the ship uh, it's a, not a very big ship but it's a like, no, good amount of ship uh, I can see lots of buses and trucks uh, there. Uh, they are parked in the basement. So basically, you can drive your vehicle and you can drive in into into the sea. Right? It's a very smooth process. And the ticket price is also very much like you know. Uh, I'm traveling with all, uh, all like you know the group. Basically, we are eight adult and uh, four kids, and all together, I think uh, uh, it has cost uh, kind of thousand uh, dollar including our uh, vehicle so just one advice if you if you are planning to visit uh, newfoundland and if you are if you if you are on rust because i am on rust i have only seven days to cover newfoundland which is not sufficient enough but i'll try to cover as much as possible but uh, if you are in in a situation like me where you need to like you know uh, cover newfoundland uh, by seven days then my advice is like no uh, just book your uh, ticket the cruise ticket uh, in advance so that you could uh, you could reserve a cabin because cabins are uh, very limited here so i booked my ticket uh, 15 20 days before uh, but unfortunately i didn't get any cabin so i i don't you know i just got a reserve seat i'll show you the reserve seat here uh, the inside uh, those are comfortable but obviously if you're if you're traveling with kids and family then obviously you would like to have a cabin definitely but uh, nevertheless you can manage right if it, 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 it all all up to you but uh, if you want a cabin you know your personal cabin you need to book all the tickets in advance okay so now i will give you a, a sort of walk around how this ship looks like like you know maybe you could you could uh, feel it before traveling here so right now i'm at the seventh floor uh, no this is the ninth floor basically so in the ninth floor inside uh, inside it's a reserved area where i have my seats okay so where you can simply sleep in the in the seats here these are windows obviously you cannot see anything right now it's dark outside but uh, this reserved area is good uh, the comfy seats are there and this is the place where you can bring your snacks or foods and you can eat here uh, like, you know, there is no restriction like that you can you can take any sofa or chair and table you, know, you can simply eat your fruit 
you can bring your food from from your home so it's again that is a video same is a video you you need to have a cabin key or they call it as a ticket so that ticket you need to punch here and then you can go inside okay so so this is the place uh, let me show you guys so these are all windows obviously in the in the morning i'm expecting it will look more good and if you want to see the sunrise then the sun deck you, you can go right so so there is a you can take uh, you need to take the stairs so these are the elevators basically i'm on the ninth floor okay so and you can take the stairs as well so this is the detailed review of mb highlander frame so by this stair you can go uh, like you know, downstairs so and there in on each floor there are two toilets one is for like you know ladies one is for chains but inside only there are two toilets right so it's very limited so let me take you to the downstairs how it looks by the way very nice scenery very nice wall paint is here so this is the eighth floor and if you see in the eighth floor you have individual cabins right if you can book your cabins then these are the cabins on the eighth floor the vehicle deck where you need to park your vehicle that is on first third and fifth floor my vehicles are parked on third floor okay the reclining chairs are here i think those are free you don't need to pay anything for this reclining chair so you can go this side and you can like you know simply sit over this reclining chair and the washroom is there everywhere okay and you have reception on the seventh floor you have a small restaurant gift store and and a bar a small bar and also you have a children's play area right? so if you have kids they can simply play around so this is the sitting area where you will get a free recliner uh, so you can, you can simply sit here so it's good actually and i can see a lot of people are sleeping over the floor that is allowed so basically these are the these are the personal cabins okay i don't have access to these cabins obviously so even if you don't get a cabin then also it's that's fine you can uh, just uh, bring some pillow and blanket and you can sleep over the floor the floors are very much comfortable it's all carpet and uh, I, I can see lots of people are sleeping over the floor. Even my family, they are also sleeping. They are, uh, they are not uh, using the recliner, recliner, the reserved seat that I have booked for them, right? So here also, uh, so it's a coffee house basically. So in this coffee house, you will, you will get some uh, breakfast, snacks in the morning. Okay, I can go there. Let me show you guys. So in the morning, you can buy your stuffs from here. Hi. Place. You can simply chill around and come with me for my breakfast and also you can buy something if you want to eat something. So here you can go outside. Outside is a smoking area. If you if you smoke then you need to go out and you can smoke. And again the same layout, the elevator on the seventh floor again, right? And here is a gift store. So that's a gift store here. You can buy gifts. So nice little gift store. There is reception. If you want to ask anything, you can ask. And uh, obviously, washroom is here. And there is a small restaurant in this seat. It's obviously closed now. It's midnight. Uh, but you know, till I think 11, not 11, I think maybe, till 12, you will get some foods. It's a bar, it is also closed now. We just had our beer here, but very nice area, you know. So, this seat, if you if you are bringing your food, you can you can have your food there, or if you want to buy here, you can buy it here as well. So, you can buy your stuff here but everything is closed now so basically if you're on a very tight schedule uh, like me you only have few days seven days then obviously you cannot uh, take the ferry the morning ferry 
right so morning ferry is more comfortable so here you have few workstation if you want to work you can work here you have few booklets and maps and all right so people are sleeping here what we have here let us see so again you can you can go outside from here if you want to see it's raining so right now i don't want to go out and if i want to go let me see yeah i can go it's very windy outside okay it's it's raining very heavy you see so it's a live live boat uh 70 passengers hopefully never going to use that <laughs> So yeah, so it's a seven, it's a seven floor here. We have something or no? So I don't want to go there. So there is a children play area as well. Right, so yeah, so that's it. So this is MB Highlander for you guys. So I don't want to go any further because ninth floor I already have shown you where you have your reserve seat. Eighth floor you have your cabins. Seventh floor you have your recliner, free recliner gift store and a restaurant restaurant with the bar and everything right and on 10th floor you have the sun deck uh, where you can you can see the sunrise or the sunset depending on the time so this is this is the you know uh, although it is written mb blue foods uh, but it's mb highlander basically so both are same so only the names are different right so uh, on daily basis you have two ships uh, that is one is starting at uh, in the morning and one is starting in the night right so we have taken this night ferry so this is again you can go outside and in the daylight i believe it would be very beautiful to see uh, the ocean here so this is the walk around uh, of this beautiful ship again newfoundland is a like a you know, very good island scenic island so if you want to visit you should have some time so that you can visit it properly uh, but again this is the mb highlander ship uh, before coming here i tried to search lots of video over the youtube hi but i didn't find any uh, so that's why i thought i should prepare one video so that whoever is going to newfoundland and whoever is going to uh, catch this ferry that will be helpful for you guys so i hope uh, this video is useful for you guys if you guys have any question you can Shoot me a question and if you are new to my channel, please do subscribe my channel. Thank you.